ಅಮೃತವಾಣೀ ಓ ಪ್ರೇಮವಾಣೀ ಓ ಪ್ರೇಮವಾಣಿ ಅಮೃತವಾಣಿ Grace and blessings of the Lord be always upon you dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus today the 5th of October we are here to reflect on the word of God in the gospel of today we see Jesus telling that parable in which the servants of the king go out into the town to invite people for the feast which the king has arranged for all those who were called did not respond properly did not respond positively so dear brothers and sisters today let us reflect our response to the call of god and st paul in the first reading today says what this call is for some the call is to be a prophet for the others it is a call to be a minister the others it is a call to be a teacher for the others it is a call to be those who advise people and for few it is a call to be at service to be those who give arms and help people whatever the call is each call is helpful for the whole and that whole is the body of christ that we are so let us reflect our response to god's call dear brothers and sisters today basically if we see dear brothers and sisters that to get the food on my table a lot of hard work has to go in someone has to cook it someone has to prepare it for it to come to my table and if i can achieve it without any much effort i would always be happy and today for such a dinner when people are invited usually we would never deny dinners here people are denying it what is the reason some say that i am busy with my oxen some others said that i have to go here and there when the lord has given his graces to us freely we are denying it we are not accepting the good that the good god is giving to us and that's where we lose our graces and the end of this parable says that one person who was there who accepted the invitation who came but he was not dressed properly for the occasion here we have to know that in the jewish custom the dresses were provided so this person couldn't even put a little effort of taking the dress and wearing it on so accepting the call is good but living a life worthy to that call is necessary so let us pray dear brothers and sisters that these two things whatever our call is call as teachers uh, call as those people who toil hard for the good of the family call as preachers call as those people who live god's life through the example of their living for each each of us let us ask this grace that we may accept our call wholeheartedly and then not only accepting live that call worthily so that our lord will be pleased by us let us make efforts efforts to please god through our life let's close our eyes eternal father i offer each and every person who is listening here today that jesus bless each one of them bless each one of them lord and give them the grace to be responsible to their call lord on the last day you are not going to ask how did your friends treat you how did your neighbors treat you how did your spouses treat you we are going to answer for ourselves so lord we ask you that we may take responsibility for our actions and live a life 
worthy of the call to which you have called us. We make this prayer through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen.